Ow. Yodale, yodale, yodale. <laughs> Hi everyone. Merry Christmas to all. And to all a good night. Oh, it's that time of the year again, isn't it? There is just something about finding out what people get for out for Christmas, which scratch an itch for the entire 365 days of the rest of the year. And you know when you ask someone what they got for Christmas and they're just like, oh, you know, the usual like clothes. I'm like, no, what clothes? What size? Are you returning anything? Babes, I need the details and everything. I'm jotting it down. Fun fact, I don't know if anybody else did this or if this was just my family. And maybe this is just why it's inherently ingrained in my brain that I'm just to be a nosy Parker. But my mom used to have a book called The Present Book. And she'd write down what every single person gave up every year. Okay, but why is my mom kind of a genius? Like, that's like literally so smart. It's the same way that I make the mental notes of who wishes me happy birthday, so for the rest of the year, <laughs> if I can get a little Instagram story with the song Birthday Girl Stormzy over the top. Don't think you're getting anything on my Instagram story, babe. This is a free promo. I'm not charity work, babe. I'm working on a shout out for shout out basis. Anyway, oh my god, bloody hell. Trotters are knocking things about left, right, and center. Also, I left all my hair products in London, so please just excuse the fact that I look like I could probably be in year five. And I'm, so, I'm at home. Anyway, yes, what I got for Christmas, as always, usual disclaimer, I am full on trying to brag. I'm trying to show off all my presents and this face and my big, gigantic completely obnoxious tits which walk through the door before I do. No, I'm joking. Obviously, I'm bragging. And obviously, Miss Odeon cinema variant, Miss Olaplex variant ruined a lot of people's Christmas this year. So if that is you, I'm very sorry you're in isolation. But as always, I do in these videos, I do a giveaway to give back as well because it's Christmas and I, I actually love giving. Like, And also, I can just, I can, I, oh my God, I can't even get my words out. I'm so excited to speak. I think I'm a fantastic gift giver. I think I should be on a committee or something. If this all goes to shit, which please like and subscribe so it doesn't. I'm gonna like apply to self just to be like the gift picker for like, when you know when it's like gifts for her, gifts for him. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna be giving away a 50 pound Amazon voucher and a 50 pound ASOS voucher. So there's actually gonna be two winners. If you wanna win, make sure you are subscribed to this video. Head over to my Instagram. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and then comment down below whatever you want. Tell me what you got for Christmas this year because I'm so bloody nosy. And your Instagram. And then I will DM the winner over on Instagram on the 2nd of January and also I'll be able to see that you're following and all that stuff and you've done all the rules. All right, enough faffing and blabbing and all. It's like, come on, babe, let's get to the punchline. <laughs> let's get on. I do slightly feel like I am a 12 year old right now. Like, I feel like I'm in a gaming chair. Like, I feel like I need a monster energy drink to go along with this. I wanted some pieces from Anne Wanda for ages and I'm like, I'm up. First thing I got, I saw my friend Megan have this and I was like, Megan, babe, I'm stealing this straight from you. It's a little Anne Wanda bag. Okay, why does... Okay, it does not look like... It looks like... <laughs> it's cute in real life, you know, for my bits and bobs. And I got an Anne Wonder raincoat. It's so cute. Is this dad core? Yes. Like, is this literally looking like? Hi, my name is David. I'm 46 years old. And on the weekends, me and my wife like to go to the Peak District to hike. Yeah, it is. And honestly, you know what? I don't effing care. Okay? And if, if you have an issue, you can kiss my bottom. Like, look at her. Oh, she's so cute. So yeah, I got those two bits from Amanda from Santa. I feel like they were my main present this year. I got a pair of Oakley sunglasses. Adding, this is just adding to the rumor that I dress like a 46 year old dad. I don't know, I feel like, I can't tell these are a bit naff, but like, <laughs> fucking air who look like I come straight off the stuff. Sorry, babe. Like, now let's make a remake of Chalet Girl and let's cast me as the main girl. Where's the representation for the Chalet boy? Why, why aren't we asking the important questions? Because, I'll break, I'll, I'll, this is my breakout role. I should hopefully be on holiday on the 2nd of January, so it will come in very handy then. Why do I look red? I've decided I want to start burning incense, and I feel like this is going to be my 2022 vibe. A mysterious girl. Come on, move your body. It's like, who is he? What is he about? What's his name, his star sign, his story, and social security number? I just don't give off mysterious vibes, do I? No. So this is the little incense holder that I got. Very cute, isn't it? It's like speckled, you can't really see that. And then I obviously got actual incense sticks as well. These are 15 sticks. <laughs> if you have incense recommendations, feel free to comment them. Oh, I got another jumper. This is from a brand called Earl. Oh, I love it. This is what I'm actually going to be wearing today for Christmas Day. We are having turkey and we're having my grandparents come around. I low-key do get scared every time my grandma comes around every Christmas. And I come down looking like I'm a member of the Madagascar 3 Circus. Can I just say, Madagascar deserved Oscars. Like, it deserved accolades. I don't know if it got those accolades, honestly. Like, it very much could have gotten accolades. I don't keep up. I'm not, I'm not following at Madagascar updates on Instagram. This is the jumper, though. It's like, I can't be bothered to zip it up. It's zip up and it's got this massive collar, which, like, you fold. Um, and then, oh, I got a film camera. To Add to my mystery um, 2022 era that I'm gonna be entering in approximately a week's time, I decided it was time for me to get an actual film camera instead of the disposables from Boots because there's the disposable from Boots, which gives you cute pictures, but there's something about having a film camera in your 
bag, which just adds a sense of mystery. Do we get the vibe I'm going for for 2022, people? Someone's like, oh my god, can you take a picture? I'm like, yeah, sure. Expect me to pull out my iPhone 12 Pro Max. It's actually not a Pro, it's a normal one. So let me not just boldface lie on the internet because that is my digital footprint, which will follow me through through to a job. And if an employer goes to employ me and interviews me and finds out I've been lying, boldface lying with my face there not on the internet, do you think I'm going to be employed? That's not a rhetorical question, I'll give you an answer because the answer is no. So let me just make sure I'm truthing myself on the internet. It's a max. No. <laughs> it just lied again. Oh my god. My nose is going to start growing in a second. They might as well call me Pinocchio. Anyway, yeah, so they expected me to pull out my iPhone 12 Pro. Almost lied for the third time, and we all know three is the magic number, which would confirm the rumors. But I pull out this instead. You're shocked, you're gagged, you're gawped, your jaws hit the floor. You're like, oh my. This. Everyone, look, get a load of this guy. And I'm just like, <laughs> this is already broken. <laughs> Basically, I got this off. E or I gave my mum a link to a, a, like a link on eBay for them because I was just like, don't bother like buying them from a film shop. People literally sell them for so cheap on eBay. And then my dad. Does anyone else's dad do this? They just think they know how everything works. It is the fifty-year-old male urge to go forward with anything with no instructions or preparations, just assuming you know how to do it because you are a man of age. So he put the film in and all that, and then he pressed the wrong rewind button, which basically broke my first roll of film. So I'm not trusting him. I'm not going anywhere near him. I'm watching you, Dad. Was that everything that my parents got me? Oh no, I got one more thing. Again, guys, this is adding to my mystery era. I love when they do these sets. I got one for my birthday from a Margiela replica, and I decided to get another one this year. This is from the brand. I just don't know how you pronounce this brand, and I feel like if I try and say this name, it's gonna come out closer to me asking for a ham and cheese croissant in French. But it's like Maison Francis Kirk de Kirk de Jan Paris. It's like the discovery set, and you get like a bunch of different fragrances. 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 Um, and you can try them all out and the point- Oh my god. And the point is that you like try them all and then you find out which one you like and you buy the full bottle. But I'm thinking- I feel like everybody kind of has a signature scent and I have for the past like eight years of my life. It's time we flip the script. It's time to rewrite this. The vibe for 2022 is no longer having a signature scent. It's not knowing what scent to expect. I have got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight! Wheat in French. Different fragrances, and you are never gonna know which scent I'm gonna turn up smelling like. It's a surprise, it's a fun game for all to get involved in. It's a four plus game though, so any children don't play along. I couldn't smell them through the top though, so I did spray them all on this thing, and I am slightly having a headache. We'll need to take a paracetamol. Love, loves, loves these, loves these, loves. Oh, I also got this, which I actually think is good. It's a skinny water bottle. Skinny! Like, I love water bottles. Do I drink water? No, but do I have the collection of like 12, 13 different water bottles? Yes. I got a mug as well. Sorry guys, I keep thinking that this is the last thing, but then I remember something else. I actually saw this mug on end, and I specifically asked for it, because if you watch my previous vlog, you now know I'm a tea drinker. I like to spill the tea. Okay, 2016. It's like a duck. I also kind of realized once I open it, this is going to be annoying, because you can't actually hold the handle. Well, you can, but... Ah. That happened. He could tell I was wifey material. Oh, do you know how tiring it is wishing every single individual that I know happy Christmas? I think it's about time as a society that we bring back BBM because I could have got that all done so much quicker just through broadcast. Brook, I did not. That is the classic saying, you don't know what you have until it's gone because I did not cherish the broadcast feature as I did. Just being able to send a message to your entire contact list. Wow. Anyway, moving on to present other people in my life got me. My little brother got me this. It's actually an electric skipping rope and it counts like every single one of your skips that you go. I actually did partake in skipping in the first and third lockdown. However, not in the second. I had a break from my skipping era and I feel like 2022. The skipping era is coming back. It's adding to my mysterious era. Sorry, you're walking through the park and you just see out the corner of your eye a man in the corner skipping. Okay, that's more creepy than mysterious. We might need to go back to the drawing board on that one for my mystery era. My older brother will be this light, and I'm pretty sure I watched Millie's apartment tour, and I'm pretty sure Millie had this light in her apartment. But a little moon and it changes color. The lovely and I, my auntie, got me a very nice white company. <laughs> she thinks I'm bougie. I always used to look at my mom. When she got white company, I was like, wow. She's so mature, one day I'll be like her. Well, that day is today. She got me a water bottle. Also got me some white company candles, but they're spa edition. And when I fucking, when I undid that wrapping paper, the scent hit my nostrils like a train. Was that a saying? No. I felt like I got teleported straight away to Champneys Spa. Is that how you say it? I don't, Champneys. I don't. No. I hate those girls which are like, it's not Champneys, it's Champneys. Like, okay, babe, we get it. You did French GCSE and got a B. Shut up. But my mum got me this. And no, this is a complete lie. And a bold faced lie. Someone arrest me. My brother's girlfriend got me this. Very, oh my god, when I saw the box, I was like, oh. oh! 
Oh, these are gorgeous. Oh my god, I'm literally actually genuinely obsessed with these. So thank you very much, Emmy. I Sorry, I forgot to say. My mum actually got me this because she saw Gemma Collins using that. I'm not saying that surprised. The first thing she thought when she saw Gemma Collins using something is that should go on Lewis's Christmas list. You basically, if I stand corrected, did I just break it? Why is everything in life so effing confusing? Again, you see the masculine urge to just try and use something without reading the instructions. There's instructions in the box, but will I read them? Absolutely not. Not me getting the masculine urge. Like, okay, come on. Ah, everything's falling. How do I do this? <laughs> Ow. Guys, is this- Oh! Is this adding to my mystery error? Ah, oh, how do you do this without hitting it in your face? Do you have to like- Do it so <laughs> Okay, this is a health hazard. This is the end of the video. Thanks for watching. I hope you all had a very Merry Christmas. Hope you all stuffed your big fat gobs with turkey or if you're vegan. Whatever, whatever you want. Flossie told me she had pesto pasta for Christmas one year. So, ever since that, I don't think you could traumatize me with what you eat. So I will see you guys very soon. Thanks for a lovely year. I think I maybe we'll post one more time before the end of the year. But if I don't, have a nice new year as well. If you can, wherever you are. Bye! Bye! Oh, look at me go! Oh my god, I got the hang of it now.